Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to our channel. Today, we're bringing you all the highlights from the Manchester City Treble Parade. It was a historic moment for the club, and the celebrations were nothing short of epic. The parade was delayed by an hour due to the summer storms, but that didn't dampen the spirits of the thousands of city supporters who gathered around St. Peter's Square. Rain or shine, these fans were ready to celebrate their team's incredible achievements. On a specially constructed stage, the players and staff finally made their appearance, and the crowd went wild. Shirts were off, chests were proudly displaying three winners' medals, and the atmosphere was electric. Videos quickly circulated on social media, showing the players' on bus celebrations, including Erling Holland pouring champagne over Jack Grealish's head and Grealish serenading his teammate Bernardo Silva. But it wasn't just the players who stole the show. Former striker Paul Dickoff, whose playoff final goal 24 years ago is etched in club folklore, entertained the crowd with his presence on stage. The fans were treated to a spectacle befitting a team that has achieved such monumental results. Manager Pep Guardiola, who led the team to victory in the Champions League, expressed his gratitude to the fans and likened the achievement to that of Lionel Messi winning the World Cup. Guardiola acknowledged that winning the Champions League gives meaning to the five Premier League titles they've won and emphasized the special bond between the club and its supporters. The celebrations didn't end on the stage. Club staff continued the party at Depot Mayfield, where 6,000 fans gathered to watch their team's triumph over Inter Milan. It was a night to remember for everyone involved. Looking ahead, Guardiola faces a busy summer as he plans for the future of the team. The futures of Ilkay Gundogan and Bernardo Silva are uncertain, but their contributions to the club will be remembered for a long time. Now, let's address some of the comments we've seen. There's no denying that Manchester City has invested heavily in their team, but their success goes beyond just money. They've revitalized a part of Manchester, brought in homegrown players like Phil Foden, and created a strong fanbase that supports the club through thick and thin. To those who question the turnout at the parade, it's important to remember that Manchester United's treble parade in 1999 was a massive event with over 500,000 attendees. Comparing the two is unfair and doesn't take away from the achievements of Manchester City. In the end, football is about passion, dedication, and the joy it brings to fans around the world. Manchester City's treble parade was a celebration of all those things and more. It was a moment that will be remembered for years to come. That's all for today's video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more football news and updates. Until next time, keep supporting your favorite teams and enjoy the beautiful game.